Hi guys, welcome back to another quick video. I'm going to try and make this as quick and short as possible. So one question that I've also been asked is how do you add your own custom indicators to FX Dreamer? You are making your own robots and you have a custom indicator that you to add to the robot how do you do that so in this quick and short video I'm going to show you just how to do that uh, first of all let me just say FX Dreamer for MetaTrader 4 is uh, for free for MetaTrader 5 I think there's a small fee attached to that uh, do what you want uh, you can make Forex robot for MetaTrader 4 and MetaTrader 5 the point that I'm driving at is for MetaTrader 4 is for free so you can make a free account like me because you actually need the dashboard to actually do that you can you can without being registered you can sim uh, simply go to fxstreamer.com and you can start what making your robots you don't need to register but if you're going to work on some project you can you just need to create a free account that's for MetaTrader 4 for MetaTrader 5 uh, you just need to pay a little sum but uh, you, you you decide what you want to do so what you want to do open a free account that's the first thing then when you're in the builder when you're in the builder there it says builder when you are in the builder this is uh, uh, the builder section for uh, uh, the FX streamer platform so you can see uh, some robots that I've been uh, working on but the point of this video is regarding what it's regarding custom indicators and I'm showing you how to do the custom indicators so if you go to conditions where we put our indicators uh, let me see if I can resize this a bit I can't it doesn't look like I can make the be the, this thing bigger but if I click there you can see there's an indicator section and there's an uh, indicator my indicator section so if you click on indicator section if you click here you can see it says custom indicator that's not where you add your custom indicators I just need to put it uh, out there this is not where you add your custom indicators in case some people have been watching my videos and they notice uh, this thing and they think that's where you you add your custom indicators no if you click on it actually is just where you can actually come up with your own indicator you can actually come up with your own indicator so you can actually create your own indicator using uh, this but uh, that's not the point again of this video the point of this video is how to add your own custom indicators to into FX Dreamer so that you can use them into your own Forex robots so the first thing that you obviously want to do is to look for an indicator from somewhere uh, this is just one uh, platform where people are posting their indicators and stuff I'm not endorsing them I'm not saying uh, they are good or whatever but I've seen people just come here and post their indicators and stuff like that so if you find something that you like and you think you can turn it into a forex robot uh, then by you can always come here and um, what get an indicator so I'll just take uh, maybe this my my experience has been that you need to use the source code so if for MetaTrader 4 it's going to be MQ4 for MetaTrader 5 it's going to be dot MQ5 not the EX4 or EX5 you need the source code that has been my experience uh, again you can always try to use the ex4 or the ex5 but my experience has been the mq4 mq5 so because i also love to get into things i, I don't want to download the ex4 and something happens and i can't tweak it i want to be able to see the source code so what you do is to just download it's going to download downloaded uh, now it is downloaded uh, our indicator now i'm going to go back to my FX Dreamer. Now in here, what I need to do is go to where it says my indicators there. That's why I said you need to open a free uh, FX Dreamer account in order to do that. Uh, if you are doing that for MetaTrader 4, for MetaTrader 5, you just need to, uh, to pay a little uh, amount, then you can make your robots for MetaTrader 5. So 
to access this dashboard you need to be in your account so you go to my indicators you click there you can see i already have uh a, f a, f a custom indicator that i already have now you're going to come to this button here that says what add custom indicator so again you are going to go into your account and you go to my indicators then you come to this button here that says add custom indicator so when you click on it it's going to take you to whatever you what downloaded so let's click here now you are going to what load from file so you are going to load where you downloaded uh the that indicator uh i'm just going to quickly uh, do that and save you uh, the trouble uh my computer is a bit slower because it's processing some people's uh banners uh in the background so i'm just going to see how quickly you can do this uh let's uh let's do this okay so back now so chosen that downloaded file and it's now loaded so it's going to give you some things about what the parameters input parameters for that indicator this indicator that we have loaded and usually also it will have buffers depending on how the indicator was uh, coded and once you have this you can also read uh, these uh, things you can also read uh, through these uh, things uh, for example you only have ex4 ex5 and you don't know what to do uh, so uh, i think uh, it goes back to where i said uh, my experience has only been through using the source code uh, uh, mql4 mql5 not the ex4 ex5 so but uh, in any way you can go and read this if you only have the ex4 or the ex5 then here it might have some a list of buffers and depending on how the uh, indicator was coded that's fine you don't need to do anything at this point you just need to just say update <coughs> done once it says done your indicator has been loaded uh, your indicator has been loaded that's all that you need to do now your job is done now you come here now if we go to condition now how do we add our custom indicator of course you are not going to find it here it's not going to be here it's missing here what's wrong what's happening what's happening so what you want to do is to actually come in this section where it says indicator my indicators indicator my indicators don't use this one if you want to add it to your robot you come to here where it says indicator my indicators you click on it and already it has taken the default which is bar hl that we just loaded there is another one that i showed you i already have and you just choose the bars hl and you do your settings whatever whatever that you want to do after that you say update and you can use your custom indicators with your forex robot so yeah if you found value with this video feel free to like the video uh leave your comments in the comment section below about everything else see the links in the description box below guys i'll see you in the next one bye